so before we proceed to next topic that is GIS I'd like to show you a video lecture on how Etraxtin German Etraxtin GPS instrument is used so this is the instrument which is available in our lab so it is a very small instrument handheld instrument okay and uh, this is the switch on button uh, right at my index finger you can see light has been written so just press that hold that button for a while just for a few seconds now it's starting instrument is starting right uh, name of the company logo and other things are coming then it will guide you to this page icon page Th these are the icon page right now these are up and down buttons over here you can see right and this is what this is the joystick okay so now what you have to do uh, so you have to just uh, scroll up and down it's going towards compass then trip compass so move down as you move this joystick this one okay it will move up and down okay so it's going down 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 we need to go to the sky page okay so let me go to the sky page uh, okay so, sorry satellite icon this is the satellite icon I'm talking about right now uh, right now I, if I go up stopwatch if I go left sun and moon go down on and face and this one satellite this is required just press this this one um, uh, joystick only just press it this page will open okay this is our sky page where latitude longitude and other things will be given so just hold for a while it it is acquiring satellite now you can see over here you can clearly see these are the satellites it's acquiring right and this is the what this is the sky page i'm talking about okay so let's wait for a while after a certain while this would acquire latitude longitude also right so now you can see all these black color satellites now you now it's very clear right you can see we do have what we do have latitude longitude over here we do have accuracy right now the accuracy is 34 meter and we do have elevation also one two five four meters over here right so you are supposed to uh, do this only right you are just supposed to take the readings okay so what you need to calculate you need to see is first is your north latitude east longitude then accuracy of the instrument then elevation since i am doing inside the lab geography lab that is the reason why accuracy is 30 meters okay we need to go outside i am doing this just for your learning purpose only okay so this is the way you can take readings from the gps let me just repeat it for you so just switch on the instrument light this light button will work this is the switch on button now company logo this is Jarmin company logo is coming right after a while it will guide you towards the icon page this is the icon page now use this this one is the joystick use this stick okay this is known as joystick this is the power source button back button and over here you can see up and down button also okay so use this joystick up down like this okay it will go we need to go to the satellite icon okay so uh, yeah this is the satellite icon I was talking about so this is the sorry this is the satellite icon I come to I am talking about okay so then after that press this button that is the uh, okay button of the joystick now so you can see sky page has appeared okay so over here what you have to take over here you are supposed to take the latitude okay you can see over here north latitude longitude then this is the sky section right then accuracy of the instrument and elevation these things are required while recording in your lab copy during examination you have to write north latitude 27 degree 10 minute um, north then east longitude 88 degree 21 17 uh, seconds uh, east longitude the accuracy is 25 over here you can see okay right over here uh, right over here you can see sorry right over here you can see the accuracy of the instrument it's 26 meter and elevation is 1 to 84 meter okay